Breaking news, ladies and gentlemen. Lionel Messi and the Argentina squad versus Mexico in the 2022 World Cup has set a new 28-year world record attendance mark. And Argentina has bounced back against Mexico, beating the Mexican team 2-0, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Greetings, greetings, and salutations, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Deep Roots TV. I'm Rastafari Soldier. In the World Cup news, ladies and gentlemen, Messi and his Argentina teammates and the Mexican side has pulled the largest attendance to the World Cup so far in 28 years. Through the whole time, a lot of people are count out Argentina. So let me get that after bat because me see all it me. Don't cry for me, Argentina. But a throne of football fans from around the world traveled to Qatar in November to watch the 2022 FIFA World Cup. The tournament grand finale may be weeks away, but the FIFA international body has really shown that they have already recorded the largest attendance in the World Cup in 28 years. Renowned footballer Lionel Messi and his fellow Argentinian face off with Mexico on Saturday in a match what would determine Argentina's 2022 World Cup match future, ladies and gentlemen. Now, Argentina and Mexico supporters arrived at the Lucille Stadium in droves and 88,966 spectators were recorded in attendance, a significant greater number than what was previously recorded at La Salle during Argentina's unexpected loss to Saudi Arabia on Tuesday and Brazil's triumph over Serbia on Thursday. Today's total number of spectators was a large, largest the tournament has seen since the final at the staging in 1994. In 1994, finally, reports saw a massive turnout of 91,194 attendants at Rose Bowl in Pasadena, California. Brazil, who have a total of five World Cup titles, claimed their fourth at the Rose Bowl, defeating Italy with penalty kick at the settlement at full time. The largest attendance recorded at the World Cup match was in Rio de Janeiro in 1950, when 173,850 gathered at the Maracana Stadium to watch the tournament finale between Brazil and Uruguay. The La, the La Salle Stadium will host several matches at the year, this year World Cup as well as the final and its largest stadium in Qatar. Now, ladies and gentlemen, may I tell you, say, Messi bounced back real well. I mean, I don't want to go on like say. Like me, me did a gallivant upon them and I laugh off for Messi. And I tell Messi, say, yo, you mess up. But guess what, families and friends? Messi has reset the world stage. And after cruising in the first part of the game, this opening defeat when the trophy is lifted is what's going to really be talked about. Because Messi was dreaming of being a champion this year. And from him lose the first match, everybody said it's not going to be his year. But listen to this. After a crushing opening defeat in 2022 World Cup, Lionel Messi dream of hosting a World Cup, hosting of World Cup trophy remain a possibility with Argentina to love over Mexico. Argentina returned to La Sola Stadium on Sunday with their 2022 World Cup champion on the hinge of a victory against Mexico. Both teams last met in September 2019 during a friendly fixture with Argentina easily coming out the winner for love. But after their shot defeat on Tuesday, many questioned their chance against Mexico which ranked 13 after losing to Saudi Arabia, which ranked 51 in the world. The first half ended with both teams picked 
up yellow cards, but being unable to secure a goal. Argentina held the ball 68% of the time for the first 45 minutes, but found themselves on the defense as Mexico pressured the goal. Mexico entered the second half without their captain, Andreas Godera, and was substituted in the last five minutes of the first half and found themselves facing more offensive Argentina. Argentina captain Lionel Messi finally delivered for his team in the 64th minute scoring his eighth World Cup goal and his second in the year this year tournament. In 87th minute, 21 year old Enzo Fernandez put an end to any hopes Mexico had of ending the game in a draw with a potential first goal and scored his first World Cup goal. Mexico has not been pushed to the bottom of the Group C, with Argentina taking the number of two ranks from Saudi Arabia. The Argentina will face Poland, with which ranked first on Wednesday. Now, ladies and gentlemen, me give thanks and praise that Messi never get lose that game, you know, because the World Cup would be bad if Messi out early in the first round. So I want to say congratulations to all of the um, Messi fan them, all of the Argentinian fan them. Big up yourself, Mexico. I saw it going on. Argentina could lose this game. Are you crazy? You don't hear what them name? Argentine. And the boss is still there. You have the claim to fame. Messi, one of the great, if not the greatest, of our time. Because they can't run in from the King Pele. You are going to a Brazil me say. Me and Mexico don't know from now. Good luck to Messi. And Argentine, but you are going to say the real team sooner or later. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Rastafari, right, soldier of Deep Roots TV, reporting here live that the Argentinian team has bounced back, defeating Mexico to love. And the teams that were there because they're going like a Messi, because people show up to see if Messi, this is going to be Messi's last game because they were scared that Messi might lose. And them now see him again. So between Mexico and Argentina, all the fans came in droves all over the place to see if Messi really did not go out like that. But Messi proved he cleaned up the mess. He's one of the best. Because when you are considered one of the best, you're supposed to rise to the occasion and show your fans them say you're strong. Make sure Mexico don't stop you. Big up yourself, people. You know it's was the far right soldier. Here of Deep Roads TV, Real Yards TV. If you have not subscribed to the Real Yards TV, become a free your TV. Hit that red subscribe button. More life. Leave your comment. More happiness. Stay blessed. <laughs> <laughs> Say from the next week, the fire them have to make sweet the lightning. The next week, the lightning them have to make sweet the thunder. The next week, the thunder got to make sweet the world. Now they so black people have put the wicked them under. Hey, Babylon, me see them afraid and them a wonder. Who flash the lightning and who roll the thunder? The push flash the lightning and him roll the thunder. But they don't miss that them a panda. Look how much of the youth them all them flat and kill how much them put under. How much of the youth them all them send a dove cut ya. Where Babylon, the fire burn no longer. Babylon, the push for that say you can't turn ya. Fire key, Rasta Fire 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 Yeah, Ron Marley, Deep Roots TV. Bless the love, see it? Rastafari.